Today, today is a very different day. God, I'm bleeding mice here. This is incredible, really. Hello, Al. Are y'all here? I'm uh, just going to use some of my artwork as a backdrop while I'm talking here. I've actually been out protesting twice since I last posted a video. First, at the monthly raid with Sea Tackning and Drifter, and that was about as uneventful as could be. We had a cop called on us who, once again, could not have cared less. And that was that. We didn't even have our picture taken, much less be followed. Now, I went back out last Sunday, which I believe was the 28th, and at least this time I had my picture taken. Uh, Sunday appears to be the day that the thin, older woman with short auburn hair works as the designated photographer and probably slave for many other tasks. For whatever reason, this woman likes to hide inside and pretend she's taking my picture all secretively. But uh, she, unlike everybody else, uses the flash. So I always notice when she takes my picture. Anyway, as you all probably know, all five of you who watch this video, Jan Eastgate, the head of the Citizens Commission on Human Rights, <laughs> has been arrested for basically intimidating an 11-year-old sexual abuse victim who had been abused for four years at that point by her stepfather into lying to police and saying that the charges were untrue just to prevent negative PR for the Church of Scientology, as obviously the Citizens Commission on Human Rights is a front group for the Church of Scientology. And they're the ones behind the Psychiatry and Industry of Death exhibit. Yeah. Anyway, this side idea was given to me by Bert. I cannot take credit for it. Thank you for the idea and for letting me know. I spent uh, pretty much the next, next 24 hours glued to my computer, hoping to see more developments, more news coverage in America, Canada, Europe. What the hell? Anyway, I feel like I can be of more use in front of my computer at the moment. Uh, I'm trying to contact as many news outlets uh, online, in print, uh, on TV as I can think of. Um, as a matter of fact, I emailed Brian Seymour and I am going to provide a screen cap of his response. And so, if any of you would like to share your stories with him, or simply send him a thank you for having the balls to cover this freaking story, um, his email is included in that screen cap. Thank you again for watching.